Hello everyone and welcome to your fourth Adobe After Effects tutorial Customizing Workspaces and Importing Files In this tutorial you will get to know about the various workspaces that are available as presets inside of After Effects and you will get to know how to create your own workspace and how to import media and files into the After Effects So first off what we have here is the standard workspace. Now this workspace is the default workspace that comes with all the Adobe After Effects programs. And this workspace basically works the best with almost all of our animating and all of our needs. So let's check out other workspaces over here. All panels animation, effects, minimal, motion tracking, paint, text, and dog panels. Now all these panels over here, as you can see by their name themselves, they have their specific tasks. For example, the all panels will contain all the panels. As you can see, composition, layer, footage, flowchart, and over here we have preview, info, audio, effects and presets, tracker, align, smoother, wiggler, motion scratch, mask interpolation, paint, brushes, paragraph, character. So all these panels get opened up when we select all panels as we can understand by its name. For now we will be using the standard throughout all of our tutorials and we will open up the new windows as needed. So let's select the standard. Now, for example, if you want to create your own workspace, you can just come over here in the menu bar, and go to the window, and just select any of the window that you want. For example, I want the character window over here. So the character and effects and presets are open over here. I want my project panel to be longer and this to be a little wider. So if I set this as my typical workspace then what I have to do is go to the workspace click the drop down and select new workspace. We just have to name it And then click OK. So let's see workspace tutorial workspace. So if we select standard and as you can see the standard is not getting back to normal as it was. So as it was told in the previous tutorials just select it go to reset standard and hit yes. So this is the standard workspace and we see we have our tutorial workspace over here and when we select that we will have our window that we wanted as we wanted. Let's go back to the standard workspace and let's learn about importing the media. You can import all kind of media over here in After Effects and to do that you can go to file, import, file or multiple files. Let's select file and then you can import any file that you want. Another way to do that is double click in this empty area and then you can import any image or any media that you want. For example, let's import this, select the file. If you want to select multiple files, just click, hit control and select multiple files. If you want to select a whole row of files, click on the first image, hit shift, click on the last and all the files will be selected. If you want to deselect any, just click control and click on the specific images that you don't want and then click open. As you can see, all the images have been imported. Same way, you can import any video or any other media inside of After Effects. 
So guys, that's it for this tutorial. We will continue working in our great software from the next tutorial. Thank you for watching.